everyone, welcome to another episode of Cooking with Molly. Today I'll be making crock pot French onion soup and all you need is sweet onion, croutons, gruyere cheese, and make sure it's gruyere, not parmesan or Swiss, nothing like that, because this is the good melting cheese. I have red cooking wine, garlic paste, beef stock, and a couple of other ingredients like salt and pepper. Okay, now I'm gonna cut my onion. I'm gonna do a thin slice. So you cut it down the middle like this, and then you turn it on its flat side, and then you're just gonna come like this. And while I'm cutting the onion, I have the crock pot on high because I'm gonna caramelize my onions. And that could take up to 10 minutes. Depends on what your temperature is on. Now I'm going to add some butter. About two tablespoons. I'm going to start to add my onion. And you don't have to worry about breaking it up because it's going to break up on its own. All right, I'm going to close this, make sure you have a lid on it, and then I'm going to cut the rest of my onion. See you back soon. Just a reminder to eliminate tears. You want to put your onion in the freezer for about five minutes before you cut them. And now my onions have been caramelizing for about 10 minutes. Now I'm going to add my beef stock which, which is concentrated. I'm going to add two of them. And then I'm going to add about eight cups of water. And then I'm going to let that sit for about 15 minutes. And you still want your crock pot on high. And you're going to let that sit for about another 15 minutes. Okay, halfway through cooking, it's been about 10 minutes. I'm going to add about 1 8 cup of red wine. It gives it color and flavor. And then I have some garlic paste here. I'm going to add about one half tablespoon. Stir that around, and as you can see, it's starting to get that color that you want. And you just have to let it cook and not and be patient. So I'm gonna put the lid back on this, and I say about another 15 minutes. Okay, now I put together some butter and flour, as you can see about half and half and then you want to roll it into a ball like so and then you want to drop it in there and what's that going to do it's going to make it thicker and it's also going to make it shiny and i do about four balls at a time and see what kind of consistency i have got going on and if you need to add more just add more and just let that sit Now we're down to our final steps. 
you can see that my suit is its right color, a rich brown. And it smells so wonderful. I wish we had smell a vision. Mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna add my croutons right on top. I'm gonna do about a bag and a half. just a little bit so that hot juice will melt the cheese and then I'm just using a vegetable pillar to shave my cheese like so okay it was better when I was doing it on the cutting board you just come across like this And you have your shaved cheese. And I'm just going to layer it like so. And then when I'm all done with my cheese, I'm going to put the lid back on so the cheese can melt. I say about four minutes. And then you have your crock pot French onion soup. Okay, guys. As you come closer, you can see that it is all delicious and melty. The cheese is all melty. And that's the crock pot French onion soup. If you do make it, please comment under my photo and tell me how it turned out. Thank you.